and welcome to Bell's Ideas. Today in this video, as I promised, I am going to show you how I painted this football field on this wall. What I did, the first step, is you paint the bottom green and you put a masking tape to separate the colors. So once I painted the bottom green, I got a stencil that I purchased at Michael's, but you can also get it on uh, at Hobby Lobby and it was about a two inch size. So you, once the green paint dries, you place the stencil over and I used a sponge to, and I just dab the white paint over it. And they, it was a pretty, pretty neat, uh, they, they, they dried very well. It didn't run onto the, to the green color. So once that was done, then I painted the line white. And of course I put another masking tape here. Another masking tape here, and another masking tape here, just to keep the colors separate. Now remember, we chose these colors because these are my son's, uh, this is my son's team, the Dallas Cowboys. But you can do it with any team of your choice. The only thing that would change, of course, would be the colors. I didn't draw these, I hired somebody to draw these football players because as I said, I'm not an, I'm not an artist. But I wanted something other than just the uh, gray, the gray wall. I wanted a little bit of artwork on the wall. This star I got uh, from Amazon. I think it was about fifteen dollars. It's a pretty thick material, and it has not peeled. It has has stayed on here very well. And I placed this uh, star after I had painted the wall. And remember to use your masking tape, you know, to separate the the colors. And the stencils, like I said, you can get those at Michael's and Hobby Lobby, and this is pretty much um, it. This is all, it, there's nothing else to it. So I hope you guys enjoy the video, and I hope you guys try it at home, and that it turns out, that it turns out great. And stay tuned for more of Belle's Ideas.